Hello, it's Huck here. Welcome back to Hammerting. If you enjoy the content, please like, subscribe, ring the bell for notifications. Somehow, I've suddenly realised that I have to get a thousand subscribers. Where am I going to find a thousand subscribers from? Hopefully, you guys will subscribe. I don't know why. It seems like a good thing to do. I'd like to try and achieve it. If Yeah, if you could do that, that would really help me out. We're after a magic number now. You've got to have goals, haven't you? It'll probably never happen. Anyway, it's Hammerting. Oh, okay. It's been a couple of days. I went out drinking. We've done that bit, so that's good. Tonight I am drinking. I am having a beverage called Full Bloom by Don Zoko. Apparently it's a sour owl with jasmine and hibiscus flowers. So, uh, yeah. That's what I'm drinking tonight. Bit weird. Hmm. And... It's a bit strange. There you go. Maybe it'll grow on me as we go through the episode. Not immediately hitting me as something I enjoy. All right, so I was mulling this because obviously we've got copper issues, we've got dwarves being crazy sods who don't move around issues. I'm not 100% sure how much these guys not moving around is, is bug related because we're in early access. But I was having a mull and you know, I've been focusing, thinking, oh, we'll go to the left, we'll go to the right, we'll go down, but what direction have we not considered as a vector for copper? Freaking up. Up. <laughs> so I thought we'd ever go look up today, see if the doors want to do it. And obviously one of my subscribers suggested using elevator stations. So thank you very much for doing that. They, they spotted the, the very clearly obvious cheaper cost of the uh, elevator station would cost two copper ore as opposed to these bleeding things which like what take you up one space and cost one so half price vertical movement as well as a lot of elevator stops so yeah awesome also build more elevator platforms but don't worry that's fine we will get onto that so let's see if anyone wants to participate uh, any doors want to participate in building or anything. Um, what else have I been mowing? Um, hopefully, after the restart, they'll start behaving themselves and actually performing. But apparently it's got something to do with hauling tasks, so... Brilliant. I, I did try and look at the uh, job broker. I, I still don't understand the job broker, but I believe when I started, it was like... It was, I don't know, it was like, like, like that, like that maybe. So hopefully this will mean that people do some stuff. Or they just, you know, break and stand there like these guys. Apparently it's some sort of bug with the hauling task, so, mm, I don't know. Maybe they'll function, maybe they won't function. They seem a little bit, uh, uh. Um, I heard a rumour, I heard a rumour, what, what, what is this, the um, Umbrella Academy, I heard a rumour that um, they they might be running out of energy and the game's not reporting it properly, I don't know. So one of the things that, that was suggested on the interwebs was build three farms, a cookhouse and like make loads and loads of beer. I mean, that doesn't sound like the worst plan in the world. Also, another thing to do, apparently a way to make money, because apparently, you know, the economy's balked up in the overworld, so it doesn't really benefit you doing that. One of the ways, and I'm going to try and do this stuff to obviously boost my game, because I feel like my game needs boosting. So, I was looking, and apparently a way to make cash is to build granite pillars. So, I'm going to start building granite pillars. A few of them. No. It's been a few days. Brains stop working. So I'm going to build like a few granite pillars. I'm going to need a few chunks to help support that granite pillar industry. So but that's fine because granite chunks are free and so is the pillars. So let us get a dwarves cracking on that. Beautiful. Right. So obviously we're going to build up. Oh my God, they've already done it. They're really good. Right. Let's carry on going up. Because I would like to say I feel like I've like 
it's a genius a genius move from me but not really is it right <laughs> I'm a genius no I'm not a genius and I accidentally started building the things I said I wouldn't build like a an absolute chode and I So, I don't quite know why that's showing there. That's a weird thing, isn't it? I don't get why that's like that. It, oh, it just looks weird. God damn, Ugg. It just looks weird. Right. Get constructing, you guys. You. Build. So yeah, so what we're gonna do, ooh, deafness, lots of deafness. So we're gonna build our farms here. So let's build our operation build farms. You see, so I'm trying to make this work, people. I'm trying to make it work. So let's build the farms. Three farms and cookhouse. I'm gonna build my cookhouse here. So it's more centralized. I'm gonna build my three farms here. And a cook house. At least we're building things again, as opposed to being slightly confused as to what we want to do. So, cook house. Uh, Alright, we won't build it there. That's fine. Don't worry. Never let it be said that Ugg is not adaptable. Ugg adaptable. <laughs> oh no. Alright. All right, I'll stop. Don't worry. Alright. Uh, there. Right. That's the first thing you do when you enter a cave. Right, what do we need? Ugh, cookhouse, you need ingots. Cool. Look at that. That's the buzz of busy industry. Um, there is hope though, there is hope. Apparently that the devs, I've been watching the forums and the devs have recognized that there is issues with hauling. They have issues, uh, issue, uh, issued issues. They have recognized there are issues with the job broker and they have said that it's very, very new and it doesn't really work and it doesn't, hasn't really been explained in my mind. No, not in my mind, just in general. Um, so, you know, fair play to them. Fair play to them, they've acknowledged that things are not quite right, but it's early access, so you know, we can't really hold that too heftily against them, really. It's just good that you know, it's good that you enjoy guys are enjoying it. I'm so I'm gonna try and make it work. This is my plan. Try and make things work. At least the dwarves are doing things now. Look, look at the buzz of busy industry, that's what I like to see. I used to have a teacher at school who used to walk in and go, Oh, it's good to hear the Buzz of busy industry instead of the cacophony of idle chit chat. Ah, that guy was annoying. Did he say that? Oh, I don't know. He said something. Bloody irritating. These three seem to be all about the. What are you doing? Don't no. Don't do that. Oh my god. One job, you guys had one job. <laughs> Sweet Christmas. This this guy knows what he's doing. No, don't get stuck there. Oh my god. If you could see me now. 
if you could see me now, people. I are shaking my head. Oh my god. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> Stupid dwarves. Oh, jeez. Right, we need floors. And now we need to sell some pillars. Uh, no, this is not the sell pillars thing. We need the ledger, the logbook of stuff. No, not that. We need the mountain ledger. And where are my pillars? Is it granite pillars? I have no idea why there are so few. Apparently they've also increased the amount people haul, the hauling distance, to improve the speed at which the dwarves actually transport stuff around the map. And they've also said they're going to increase the amount of um, storage space available, which is, which is good. I can only say I approve of these changes. Uh, where's the granite, granite beams? Can I put them in a warehouse, a storage room? Right. Um, accept content. Not so much. Gotta try and get them their pillars. Oh no, they are accepting that these they should be sold, which is good. Great, more granite pillars to sell. Excellent. Right. Uh, they've, what else are they, I was reading, apparently they're going to put inventories into the dwarves so you can see what they've got on them, which is nice. I mean, these guys seem a little bit buggered now. Alright, so maybe we need more copper. Right, now I'm going to try and build one of these things, because apparently, you know, it does give you more copper. Although, I can't see how it's going to work, but there you go. Where is this guy going? Right, so, I told you to craft 15 of these, 15 of, oh, and 15 of these. But I'm going to do 30. And 30 of those. And then... 15 of these, or 20 of these, whatever, it doesn't really matter as long as I make the same of everything, I guess. Um, no, right, 40 of these. So that means we can make a very, 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 bunch of, bunch of beer. There you go, bunch of beer. Maybe that much beer. I don't know. Probably. So hopefully the doors won't. They won't be wanting beer now. Which I think we can all. Uh, the only thing we can ask of the dwarf is to not want beer. Right. Waiting for copper sheets. Hopefully they've got copper sheets. I don't know. 
Copper ingots, copper sheets. We've got copper sheets, good. All right. It would be nice if you could pick these up and move them. Right, with a bit of luck, they will uh, drink this beer and there'll be much rejoicing. And oh, good, they've sold those. They've sold those things. We've made some money. Good. All right. Let's make these granite pillars. Grr, it's a granite pillar. Yeah, all right, we've got some more of those. I mean, it looks like it's going to be somewhat painful. Hopefully the dwarves will drink a lot of the, I don't quite that is, a granite chunk. I don't know what the guy's dropping a jack, granite chunk there for. He seems to have produced lots of beer though. Good. It's weird the way these pillars work and the cells and stuff work. I don't really understand how it works. I've no idea where those granite pillars that are marked for sale are. Just somewhere in the system. <laughs> well, they don't sell for a lot. They're like 32 copper each. But... I guess that's better than a punch in the face. I mean, you know, I'll just I'll buy that for a dollar that they're getting into the sale system. So um This machine seems to be doing its business. I mean, it's got a bunch of copper. Hmm. Ah, I know what's going on. Need to build one of those. Got it. I know what's going on. Badly. Okay, alright. You want another one of those? My god, they already want more than I can give them. Well, it does seem to be a little bit more productive than it used to be, which is nice. It turns out that my dwarves are just fueled on beer. It's all they want, just beer, beer and more beer. Let's see, have a look at the Sea of the War, shall we? Right. What's going on? What do they need? Ugh, machine parts. Okay, they can have some machine parts. Well, we'll give them those. Right.
Okay, sweet. It's going well. Okay, this works. Look, the copper. Okay, so they need more elevator platforms, but that's fine. They can now have elevator platforms. Can rain in copper. Going for beer anyway. There's loads of beer. We got loads of beer. Yeah. Right. Hey. We got ingots. We got beer. We've got everything. We've got loads of granite pillars to sell as well. I've got beer. We got money. Oh, everything's coming up dwarf like. Hashtag fumbled for a bit there, you know, but it ain't about falling down. It's about how you get yourself up off the ground. Yeah. Right, well, we can't build elevators everywhere, so we're going to have to build some um, stairs so we get to these resources. How's this thing doing anyway? Is it still full of ore? It's still got some ore in it. Let's we'll see how far we can go. Oh, 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 mouse, mouse. Oh, stop it, game. Stop, stop it. Weird. We might have hit the top of the map. Yep, that's the top of the map. That's okay, because this works well for like mining stuff out. Right, let's get this done. Sorry, this is going well. Oh, 
copper. Precious. I mean, it's not precious, but it's more precious than not having any copper, to be honest. It was a big major stumbling point that we were lacking in, so having loads of it will be really handy. All right. 20 gold. Time to make some, sell some more pillars, or 20 silver. Right, good, good, good. All right. Uh, pillars, pillars, pillars. Oh, so many pillars. All right. This guy's like banging out pillars. That sounds wrong. We got plenty of beer. Um, we need, uh, we should build some more. Well, uh, uh, oh, two more of those, and two more of those, and two more of those, and oh. And then, uh, so that's uh, my beer's time, beer timetable. Oh, we can build about that, that many, right. So we've got 20 gold, good, or 20 silver. We should build another dwarf house and get another sudden dwarf in the house. All right, good. Oh yeah. What do you need then, you would? Pillars, we got pillars. We're gonna get another couple of dwarves in. It's going to improve life if we can get more dwarves. Money means we get more money, more dwarves. Well, we could complete that. Yep, yeah, do that. Good. Huh, <laughs> Cope, you still there? All right. Well, this seems to be working out. We've got all the stuff we need to build these, probably. Yep. Yeah. Gives us enough resources for another couple of dwarves. We'll buy these. See, with money, you can buy, you can build dwarves. All right, sell these. That's what we want. More dwarves. More money. Yeah, good. And then more copper. Yeah, plenty of copper up here, which is good. Got to expand. Right, got to put something in there. Put something in there. Don't really need to do that, actually. That's pointless. But we do, uh, we are looking for the copper in here. So, well, iron, coal, good. I mean, this is great. I mean, loads of loads of copper here, loads of copper here. So what we need? This lift, this lift idea was brilliant. <laughs> cool. Right, bone ash. Oh, we got one bone ash. Now, I understand they eat mortar, which is bad, which is something they they fixed. So we're waiting for mortar here for the quarry, and we're waiting for mortar here for the foundry as well. But you can't build. We need one bone ash, which we've got one in the in the in the in the world. Oh 
Iron is fine. Right. Yep, we sold. We got 20, 31 gold now. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Sell those granite pillars. We are pretty badly in need of getting out to these places to actually grab this metal. So, right, uh, hopefully, we've got loads of copper ingots now. Wow, well, we haven't got loads of copper. Or oh, we got 27. That's better than like we had before. I keep saying those pillars. Right. Right. We got 35 gold. We uh, we have. Let's see if we can recruit some more dwarves then. Oh yeah, up oh, behind you, and we're higher. Yeah, two more dwarves. So the first thing first, build your sodden houses. Right, these some ingots. Brock of granite, lumber. Lumber is being counted for. Oh, they are building their own houses first. That's uh, incredibly appropriate. Yep, it's being dealt with. It's all being dealt with. Right, building all that out. What's that coal? At least I know where the roof is now. I feel nice and safe. I know the limits of my domain. Right. If there ain't enough beer there, I don't know how much beer dwarves need. Look at all that beer. That lovely, lovely beer. Right. Keep on serving people. Every granite pillar you sell helps keep a dwarf in beer. That dwarf's loaded. Look at it. So is that one. So is that one. I've got all my money, little bastards. So just some blocks of granite, which I'm sure we can produce quite quickly. Right. What does it take to make a block of granite chunks? Good.
Yep, good, good. We'll just mine all this out. I suppose that's the sort of like structure that the dwarves should actually have, leaving behind all that stuff. Also, if you do this, it lets you, yeah, this is brilliant because you can just set up a structure and then they can just mine and it, it works just really well. What's that? Who knows? Let's go rummage through it though. Well, all this stuff. Let's just harvest that. Harvest that. Harvest all this. That. And that. And these. Don't want mushrooms lying around. Mushrooms standing idle. I guess we just pick another spot to go up then. Maybe here? Yeah, that's the way to do it. That's the way to eke out these places. Filling need of small foundry with coal. Okay, that's good Good of you. Do I click on the wrong one? Right, right. Right. What's that? Oh, we should harvest that. Yeah, right, sweet. I mean, the only annoying thing is they're kind of stuck on these lifts a little bit. Uh, we can fix that though. Um, Build your own lifts to get up there. I mean, it's going to be pretty pointless, but I mean. of what what have we got this time okay we can give those four of those we can make floor tiles as well right um, we need machine parts iron sheets Wait, okay, all right. Granite chunks. All right. How are we doing for beer? We got quite a bit of beer. Good. Lots of this stuff, and then build maybe gloom wheat. What does it need? It just needs fuel. Okay, sweet. All right, level this dwarf up. Not the best dwarf in the world, but that's okay. We can train them. Maybe we'll take that away and give them a little bit more in the deftness department right uh, we got one dwarf here and we need to assign you a home yep, assign and what are we waiting for all right blocks there we go 
get those built. Uh, block, block. Can't have dwarves without homes. Right, these dwarves are leveling up. Yep, good. Good, don't be crap. That's the trick to being a good dwarf. Got plenty of gold. Let's try and make some more. I haven't got gold, I've got some of these things though. Man, that guy's good. It's like level 32. It's like a, a Methuselah of Dwarven strength. All right. Awesome. Um, all right, I don't know why you're sort of lurking on that. Have you not got an elevator or are you just like going weird? You're going weird. I can accept that though. Okay, right. Nice. We've got a few more leveling up to do. I think we made good progress this one we got like loads it doesn't say we've got loads of ingots but there's copper all over the top level which is brilliant it's not quite you know ideal but we've got like 38 now we've got to build this dwarf in home which we will do shortly build this up yeah, good Right, awesome. Mm-hmm. Oh, this guy's brilliant. Look at how good his skills are. Why is he so good? Who knows? What does beer do anyway? Beer restores morale. Where don't you get energy back then? Hmm. Energy, uh, okay. Mushroom stew. I need mushrooms for stew. Mushroom stew, that is. Actually, what we can do is we can build mushroom building mushroom stew uh, down here with uh, the mushrooms. They need mushroom stew. Stew, they can have it, All right. All right, I think we've bored this out enough. Beautiful. I mean, we've got copper here. We'll go down and get that in a minute. I'm looking for another place to like eviscerate when it comes to like mining. Maybe this big green chunk. I was looking here. Look, look up here. It just seems to be a massive chunk of like green. I don't know whether this bit up here has got anything to do with it. I don't know. I'm going to have to have a look around, find another good place to sort of like hollow out. Yeah. Right. Nicely done. Yeah, we got a bit of uh, a bit of wealth now. A bit of wealth coming in as well. Got to be done. It's got to be done for the um, good of dwarven kind. All right, we'll send that off. We've got our houses. Our final dwarf has been assigned to their dwelling. We're up to 11 dwarves. We're up to 46 monies.
Things are going all right. I think that was a much better time. Um, like I say, we need to find ourselves a good place to like dig through, and this place is looking ideal, an ideal place to sort of exploit. Not that dwarves would ever exploit an area for their own wealth. Ooh, copper. Yeah, yeah. Actually, you know what, I totally would. And then we need to do it to places like this as well. That's the way to succeed. I think I've, I've got a way now. There is a way. Okay, but that way is not right now. So, just like to say, if you've got this far, thank you for watching. It's most appreciated. Um, like I say, I have got a, a mission, one prize, one goal, to get 1,000 subs. I know it seems like a long way away, but I'm sure we can do it. And it would really help me out if you could. Um, I will uh, see you next time for more hammer ting. Later, guys. Thank you.